Hello, sweetheart. I feel to share with you some intuitive understandings and my own personal experience with hidden family loyalties, how to recognize them, to understand what they are, uh, where do they come from, and how to heal and release them. Because once you recognize them and work on changing them, it can be such an eye-opener and literally change your whole reality. So subconsciously, we all are wired for safety, survival and belonging. And we want to feel safe and secure and to belong a tribe. And there is this idea that energetically we, especially as children, uh, want to match the vibrational frequency as one or both of our parents uh, because uh, our survival depends on them and we want to feel safe, loved and to belong. And as a child, you hold your parents in the highest regard because you love them unconditionally and you see them as a part of you and you want to stay loyal to them and uh, to what they tell you. And where it really can get tricky is if you have experienced dysfunctional family dynamics and one or both of your parents uh, were really toxic or uh, had uh, narcissistic abusive uh, traits uh, and treated uh, that way you or uh, the whole family. And those of us who have experienced these toxic uh, dynamics, it is much harder to recognize these hidden loyalties because they are correlated with uh, big fear and uh, deep mother and or father wound. However, it also can be difficult to recognize these hidden family parent loyalties because they are ingrained into our subconscious mind in the early stages of our life uh, between ages 7 and 9 when we mostly experience everything through our uh, feelings and emotions and uh, our rational mind and understanding hasn't yet developed. So then, as adults, uh, we tend to sometimes sabotage ourselves and no matter how uh, brilliant is our thinking and how talented we are, we tend to slip back into these old patterns uh, and waves of being and thinking in order to subconsciously stay loyal uh, to one or both of our parents. I also want to share my recent experience and one of the biggest emotional release and self-empowerment moments uh, by recognizing, healing and releasing my hidden loyalty to my father. I haven't been able to recognize and release this hidden uh, loyalty to my father whilst he still was alive and it has taken me so many years, uh, most of my life up till this moment uh, because of the fact that it, I have carried such a deep pain in my heart uh, and in my uh, core uh, because of this hidden loyalty. I always have felt more emotionally attached uh, to my father uh, and in the same time I have felt this deep resentment and anger both towards myself and my father. Because of this hidden loyalty to my father which I loved so much and wanted to be loved by and validated by, I have been feeling stuck in uh, doing the work which the hard work which uh, my father wanted me and us to do uh, to hang around and connect with people which i never felt really connected with and um, engage wanted to engage with 
and uh, just to go this traditional route. Yet uh, deep in, in my heart, uh, I always have been craving for freedom, independence and going and living my life in unconventional way, yet I haven't been able to understand which what is uh, really stopping me from doing so and not being able to speak my truth, uh, express my needs, uh, because I have felt this guilt or, or uh, some kind of un invisible attachment to quite the opposite. And when I realized this hidden loyalty to my father and uh, this uh, fear of disappointing or letting him down, uh, otherwise I would risk his love and protection, I was really able then uh, uh, go back to this part of myself and uh, to heal it and release it. So I would like to share with you the exact steps what you can do to recognize, heal and release these hidden loyalties towards one or both of your parents and also offer you the energy healing and activation to facilitate this process for you. So when you have time, I invite you to find yourself into this energetic space where you feel deeply connected with the, your family within you and uh, bring your inner child with you. Identify the hidden loyalty that you have for your parent or both of them. And uh, what also might be really helpful for you uh, when connecting with uh, your mom or your dad uh, would be if you could find a picture of them because that might bring a really powerful emotions for you and you tell the parent uh, that I love you and it is safe for both of us to release this struggle from each other and I respect you and I ask for your blessing for me to break free so I can move forward. And please allow yourself to express any emotions, uh, feelings or thoughts, what you always have been wanting to express to your parent, but never allowed yourself to do so. And really acknowledge and validate that part of yourself, which has been stuck into this space. Kia no sukuranai anata kana ua. Ki na sukuranai a ti anata kaua. Ki na sakarai a nu kana takati. Ki na sukurunu e anu sukurana ua. Ki na sakaranai a. Ki na sakaranai a ti kutukurai a ti. You are lovable. You are lovable no matter what, even if you lose, even if you choose yourself, even if you break free, you are lovable and you are worthy. I love you, I love you, I love you. Ki na sakaranaya tukuru na ua, kaneya se ki anu tukura naya, ni a katanaya se ki anu tukura ua, keya nu kura nataya. Eia na si, ki ana tukura naia, i na kataua, ki na takaraia, eia na taia, ki ana seia, i ana tukura naia, kati. With love, I let go of any vows, any contracts, any agreements, any promises, any pacts, any attachments, any cords that I made to you, mom or dad or I made to myself, which is keeping me stuck. I let it go from all levels, timelines, dimensions and realities. And I call my power back. I call my voice back. 
I release this hidden loyalty from my energy field on all levels, from my DNA structure, from my blood cells, from all the levels of my body's consciousness and soul peace. And I replace it with my true essence, with my truth. Kia no sukurenaya, tina takataua. Kia na sakaya, nutu kurenateya. Ina takaua, keia alua katina.